They say what I'm doing is dangerous. I was told when you interact with spirits, sometimes you can run into things that are worse. The spirits or entities can become attached to you. They see you as a source of energy, feelings, emotion. They can change you and turn you into something that you're not. There have also been documented possessions they say were from demons, evil entities that take over someone's complete life and soul. They cause them to do things they do not want to do, and in some cases, the ultimate sin of taking another person's life. I have a drive, a desire to find out more, to learn about paranormal activity, see if I can interact and see what kind of relationship can form if you continually engage. My name is Mike Tornacasa. This is my channel, MT Paranormal Life. What you're going to see here is unlike anything you've seen anywhere. I'm going to continue to build ongoing relationships with the paranormal. Join me and let's see what awaits in this unknown paranormal world. In this part, I'll be investigating a home in Northeast Ohio. The homeowner reached out to me and told me about the paranormal activity. She believed it was the previous homeowners. She explained to me who they were, a man and a woman, Gordon and Marjorie. She believes the spirits of Gordon and Marjorie still haunt this home. So I reached out to my gifted friends. After talking, we had come to the conclusion that this was a case of attachment causing this haunting. The previous homeowner's items were all still in the basement and out in the garage shed. We believe their spirits were still attached to these items and that's why they will not move on. Join me as I investigate this home and watch and see what happens. If you look at the TV, you can see my reflection, but like somebody was sitting right there. <laughs> well, I hope I don't take anybody's seat tonight. This has a um, light red means it went up five degrees. If it goes blue, it means the temperature dropped five. Okay. Ooh. Hi. <laughs> what did it? Spiked. Whoa. Hi. And my hairs are standing up. Hello. I am I'm not out of my spirit box. Walk too many things. That's not me. I can just. I can. Well, there you go. Well, hi. Hello. Hope you don't mind if I sit here. Okay. Not who built the house. The house was built in 1850. I do know that. Okay. Um, 1850. And you said it was one of the first 50, right? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Maybe it is you, Marjorie. Thank you. Is this Marjorie? Yeah. Hello, Marjorie. I, that seemed like a. An affirmative there. Well, oh, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Wow, that that's impressive. That's dope. Wow, you got a lot to say. You saw the tenant too, though. Never mind. It's been going off since like that. Turned it on. Wow. We're listening. I've got devices to listen, so please continue the conversation. I'm sure with us now here, of us, mm -hmm. as we as I'm here longer with you, that'll probably transfer more energy, maybe even more communication that way. Mm -hmm. All right, well, I'm going to stay for a little while and just talk to you, Marjorie or Gordon, whoever's with me, both of you. So um, if you want to just come around with me and talk to me, that'd be great. I wish I knew how many are here. Because huh? I actually think that there are something that's going on. Yeah. Is that, is that beeping coming from there? 
Yeah, that's, that's like my my washing machine or something is yeah. like like somebody's programming it. Okay, let's go see. We heard, my, my heard the noise out here in the uh, laundry area. Hello? Are you messing with my washing machine? Or somebody is. Yeah, it can beep too. Hello. I'm going in there with them. You know, it was definitely like this with the sound of like your uh, washer or dryer, mate. Does that sound like it? Wow, hello. Look at the EMF, it's spiking like crazy. In there. Appreciate it. Can you make it light up if you're still here? I was going to go, oh, hi. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Wow, that's a nice spike. Look at that. Yeah, that's all the way over. Yeah. Yep. And I am charged up again. Was that you that was making those beeping sounds from the other room? Can you do it again and show us that you can? That was like a new trick. <laughs> Because usually you hear the dryer door open, close, open, close, uh -huh. open, okay. close. And I'll go in there and the dryer door is not opening and closing. All right, so I'm going to head down in the basement and see who wants to come down and talk to me. Well, look at that EMF spike. Look at that. Okay, all right, I hope you're excited about that. Whoever's with me, if it's Marjorie or Gordon, I'm going to go down in the basement, okay? I'm going to bring your flowers down there, Marjorie, and put them down there, okay. and I'll, I'll talk to you. Touching them. This device will let me know you're here. See? Just touch it like this. You can touch this device here to let me know you're here also. And then these devices here, if you wish to talk to me, you can come over to these devices and talk to me. Evelyn. Evelyn. I also have a round device here. And I have a round device up here on the shelf by one of the, your glass jars. You can also touch those. I'm going to go get flowers that I brought for you, okay? I'll be back. People hear my voice. I'm listening. Here's flowers I brought for you, Marjorie. I brought these flowers here for you. I'm just going to set them over here, okay? I'm going to set them by your shelf. I'll be back, okay? I have to get some more things. Grace. Hi, was that you? Marjorie, was that you? Again? Gordon, if it's you, Gordon, would you touch the device again for me? If it's you. Somebody else? Obviously. <laughs> okay. Could you tell me your name, whoever's here with me? Okay, I'll be back. I have to get some more things. Okay, I'm back. Did you miss me while I was upstairs? I hope that was a yes. Arthur. Arthur. Well, Arthur, is that you? By touch You're very close by. You're very close by. Was your funeral here? My friend, would you tell me your name, please? Look at that. If there is anybody here with me, could you show me that you're here by touching this device here? Just so I know you understand what I'm saying? Okay. Be careful. Okay. I noticed some things. 
like the shed outside. It looks like that was your work area, Gordon. And it looks like it's kind of in ruins right now. And I thought maybe I could help clean that up. If that would be all right with you. I feel a charge. Somebody's here. Powerful. Can we keep talking? Yes, we can, my friend. That's why I'm here. Hi. I see you noticed the device here. That's there for us to talk to each other. If you would like to just say hi, you can touch that device. My name is Mike. <laughs> cool. Cool. All right. Yeah, it is cool, huh? It's very cool. Are you able to open and close the cabinets upstairs? Somebody's been doing it. Is it you? Would you mind letting me know, showing me that you could do it and open the cabinets upstairs? Hello, my friend. Whoever's here at this device. It's nice to meet you. I would like to know who I'm talking to. If Talk. Yes. Talk to me. Tell me whatever you'd like. That's what I'm here for. Marjorie, are you here? I put a ball here on your shelf. Would you touch the ball over there on the shelf for me and let me know you're here? Eric. Oh. I'm sorry if you were hurt. If you're hurting, if I can help by talking to you, I would like to do that. Any other souls? Okay. Lots of you here. Thank you for talking. Oh, you're welcome. I'm glad you like my presence here. Gaining more energy. Okay. Post. Setting up a camera in the other room over there in case you want to interact with me. Well, hi. Hello there. I see somebody else is here. Carson, if you're here, would you mind touching this device for me here? I think somebody was just trying to touch it. Well, hi there. I'm going to take one of these devices over here into the other room in case somebody wants to communicate with me in there, okay? Boy. All right. Well, my friends, if you, um, if anybody's over here with me, I have some devices here. You can see this one right here. Let me know you're there. And I got a round ball over here, a device here. You touch that and let me know you're here. I'm going to go ahead and um, go over to the other side. So if you feel like checking them out, feel free. My ashes are here. Birdie. Hi, Birdie. You know where the switch is? It's beautiful here. Well, hi. Who's here with me? Birdie? Someone said their ashes were here. Is that Birdie? Who can help me? If anybody can hear me, if you can hear my voice, would you come over to me 
and let me know you're here. I've got a device right here in front of me you can touch. Or you can touch this device in front of me. It looks like somebody's here. But would you touch it for me, please, if somebody is here with me? Just let me know you're here. I'm just here to communicate with you and talk. Stand by it, stand over it, and just touch it. standing up I feel static charge I've been feeling it constantly since I've been around here I said somebody is here with me I hope if there's people here you're not too lonely that nobody talks to you but I just wanted to let you know that I'm a friend and I'm here try saying something I can hear you maybe anybody's here can you hear me participate. would you like to participate in a discussion here? Come talk to me. Tell me your favorite sport. Did you like to play sports? Are you happy here? Could you tell me yes to any of the questions I'm asking? If you do you not want to talk to me? If you don't want to talk to me, can you touch this device and let me know that? I'm gonna go back over on the other side. If you would like to check out the devices I left here, feel free. Coming back over here. Wow, I see somebody's here. Where's she? There's life after death. Wow, thank you for whoever's here. This device here, if you can see it, I'm holding. This is just a way to talk to me. I'm going to turn it on and ask a couple questions, and if you'd like to answer them, I would appreciate it. I would like to know if Marjorie's here. Marjorie, can you tell me if you're here? Tell me in this device I'm holding. I would like to know if Marjorie's here. Marjorie, can you tell me if you're here? Tell me in this device I'm holding. Please, Please don't, don't try to harm me. I am here as a friend. I mean you no harm. I'm enjoying this. All right, well I'm glad you're enjoying this. Okay. Johnson. I would like to know if Marjorie's here. Marjorie, can you tell me if you're here? Tell me in this device I'm holding. Okay, again, my name is Mike. If somebody is here with me, can you come over to this device and tell me your name? Okay, again, my name is Mike. If somebody is here with me, can you come over to this device and tell me your name? I didn't hear reply on that. I will appear. I'm here, my friend. If you'd like to show yourself, can you show yourself? Stroke. Stroke. Marjorie, are you here? Okay. I am holding the device here. This is what it's on screen. If there's anybody here, would you come over and say something to me? I would appreciate it. Thank you.
confused. Okay. Gordon. Sir, I'm here. I would like to know if you're here, Gordon. Could you tell me yes or no if you're here? Ooh. Got a static charge. My hair is standing up. Sir, I'm here, and I'm here. I would like to know if you're here, Gordon. Could you tell me yes or no if you're here?